And now, Hawaii's most accurate weather with Kamaka Pili. Another shot from today. Mahalo to Rick for sending this. This is from Kalau Papa on the island of Molokai. Not much cloud coverage. Of course, we've seen more cloud coverage for the islands of Oahu here on Oahu and the island of Kauai. Now, looking for tomorrow, the jellyfish are here for the south facing shores, so make sure you're aware of that before you jump into our south shores. We have that moderate threat because a, a small craft advisory for the, west, uh, the east side of the island. That's at least until Sunday tomorrow at Six o'clock in the morning, but of course we do have also larger sets rolling in for the south-facing shores. So as fun as those waves may be for you surfers, just be aware. Of course, we do have those box jellyfish. Now, looking at what we have around our atmosphere, we don't have much going on. All of this is not really moisture. It's really that cloud coverage again for Oahu and Kauai in particular. While the middle to the east end of the state's been seeing a lot more blue skies. Now we have light. Well, we have the trade winds that returned last night, but before that was very light, and we're going to expect. These trade winds, even though it's coming in, it's quite humid. It's because of this cold front that's really sitting stationary north, uh, northwest of the island of Kauai, about 300 miles or so. But that's going to be pretty stationary because this low pressure system up at Alaska is going to pretty stationary up there as well. So we're going to have this throughout the week. We have this high pressure system that's bringing those trades in, but even though we do have these breezy trades, it's quite warm. We're going to lose these trades just in time for Memorial Day. So starting Memorial Day, we're going to see some light and variable winds out there, afternoon showers because these sea breezes will be coming in. Now looking at what we've seen for the past few uh, 24 hours, very light across the islands. Really topping off the charts was on the island of Kauai here on Maui, Wailuaiki, and the northern portion of Hawaii Island. Just some sprinkles but other than that, fairly dry conditions, especially for the leeward sides. And that's the, the fashion we're going to see moving into tomorrow, moving into Memorial Day. So we're looking to have mostly dry conditions for our Memorial Day holiday. But keep those fans handy, keep those water bottles handy, because even though the tray winds are back, at least for now, we're going to start to lose the Memorial Day, which means our temperatures and our heat outside is only going to increase. Checking out our head in Alu again, box jellyfish down south shores, five to eight. So it is some fi fun sized waves, but just remember we have those friends visiting us as as well. Now for Memorial Day, again, we're going to start to lose those trade winds at least until the middle of the week, hopefully be returning on breezy conditions next weekend. Kathy, back to you.